I'm pleased to say I'm getting back on my feet again, although obviously I'm always going to be steady nowadays. So I just take it uh, steady in the morning and really pace myself in the afternoon. You know. Anyway, we're slowly getting there and I can do something again. So, what I'm going to do now, I've been playing with the typewriter, I've worked out what happened to it, I'll tell you, and what we've done. So, uh, we've got it to work, but it'll, um, without a great deal of effort, it won't be quite right, but it works. I'll show you. Well, what's happened is, sometime in the last 25 years, when it's been stood on here, the carriage has been pushed violently that way. Very violently. And what it did, um, it broke the end of this off. As I think you can see, I'll turn against the light, there we are. I've uh, made a new end for it. Which took me a bit of try time and effort, but it was worth it. The only problem is, I can't use it. So I'll show you why. I'll tip it up. Now, mind not to tip it off. And I'll show you what's happened. Underneath there, you can see there, there's those two, well they're not wheels are they? Anyway, what's happened is, the bottom one, that one, has got a spring in it. And what you do, you wind the top one up against the spring. And then this strap attaches to the top one. And it pulls it round a bit, and then it goes out the top and along and pulls the carriage along. Anyway, what's happened is, as you can see, in the bottom one, the spring is broken. Right? So that's... Um, I've had to come up with a different method of working the carriage, but it works. That's all that matters. So I've given it quite a clean up, as you can possibly see. Not too extreme, you know, but... We've done quite a bit to it, and uh, as I say, the main thing is, it is up and working. I'll show you. Now, right, put some paper in, oh, I, I bought a new ribbon for it which I've fitted, as you can see, cleaned all that up, and uh, a bit hard putting paper in one hand, isn't it? There we are, I've just got to hold it with that hand, that's it, right, it's not quite level is it, but it's level enough <laughs> for our demonstration, right? Uh, so I will just show you, now what you have to do is pull that back to there and you set your stops which aren't at the moment, but what I've done to pull the carriage along, I've tied some thread onto that end of the carriage and then Using this lock as a weight, that's what's pulling the carriage along. So I think it's a <coughs> effective alternative repair, to be honest. You know, because it works. So, just to show you it works. I can't, uh, sorry, I can't type one handed very well. 
There we are. I'm sure you can see that it works. Look. See? It now works. It's got a new ribbon on it. And as I say, barring I've had to find an alternative method of pulling the carriage along. Um, it now works pretty well, to be honest. So uh, it's only in a, you know, an ornament, but it, we can now demonstrate it. That's the thing. And that's what it's all about, isn't it? So we've had it off a lot, but as I say, that's what happened to it. That's what happened to it. The carriage got pushed violently that way, which came to a sudden stop, broke the spring that pulls the carriage along, and it broke the end off that piece. So now we know what's happened to it. So at least it works again. That's the main thing. So there we are, all cleaned up, ready to go. Yeah, do you like me? Nice little display I've got here. Cars at the back, look. And the rosettes at the front. Hey, Tidied it up, haven't it? Anyway, I thought I would just give you, as I say, an update, you know, on this. Oh, and it does, by the way, uh, that it's got a new ribbon. And just to show you, it does, in fact, write in red. There we are. See? How about that? So it is now fully functional, even though we've had to affect a different method of pulling the carriage along. But uh, yeah, I'm happy with that. Well happy with it. You know, plenty near enough, isn't it? So it's not only an antique ornament, it's now a working antique ornament. How about that? Right. I'll leave you with that. And uh, we'll see what we can find for you in a day or two, hopefully. So, like I said, as I said, I am okay, but I've got to be very careful and I do have to pace myself, you know. So in the morning I'm being very steady, in the afternoon I'm pacing myself and I'm, you know, I have uh, probably 10 minutes and five minute rest, you know, doing stuff like that. But at least I can do something, eh? Which is a lot better than I was a little while ago. All right, have fun everyone, see you soon.